everybody. Are you enjoying the summer today? Um, I am because we're doing the Holger 26 Fruity Waters here as our featured gun for this video. Today we also have Bathysphere Fuzzy Monster, so that's kind of fun. Um, but let's talk about the Holger 26. I haven't used this gun in a little while. Fruity Waters, you can definitely tell there's a summer theme going on here. We got lemons and limes bobbing up and down in the water here. At least I think those are limes. But I wanted to do something very different with the Holger 26 that I haven't seen anybody else do. Um, we've got two important attachments here to start with. We've got one of these magazines that decreases the ammo by a lot, but decreases your ADS time and reload time and increases your movement speed. So that sort of turns the Holger 26 into like an assault rifle rather than the slowness of an LMG. Also, the no stock perk, which you should always use on any Holger 26 gunsmith, increases the ADS movement speed by 40%. Um, so I think between those two attachments, that this one turns it into an AR, I think, and then the no stock in combination with that basically turns it into an SMG. Um, so the reason that's important is because I'm using the disable perk today, which is great on LMGs, it slows down movement speed for any hit to anywhere on the body. We basically got an SMG with the disable perk, so that's why I'm excited to try this out today. And then the other two attachments, the laser is pretty standard, and then I don't like the iron sights on the Holger, and there aren't any custom iron sights on this Epic Camo, so we've got the classic red dot sight here. Um, all of that brings our stats down to this. And then if you want to see the movement speed, we'll look at this quick here too. The uh, regular movement speed is pretty high too, and then for an LMG, the aiming movement speed is also pretty high. So let's go inspect this quick. All right, side weapon inspect here. Lemons and yeah, that definitely looks like limes that are not sliced. So we've got some side to side movement speed. Not, you know, not quite as fast as the fastest SMGs like the Switchblade or the Fennec or anything like that, but still pretty fast for an LMG. And this is the regular movement speed. So I'm pretty excited to try this out. Let's not wait any longer. This should be an interesting match because this is this map is kind of like pick a side and then use that side. And there's not really many opportunities to cross over. Um, but hopefully this unique gunsmith will do well here. Okay, so here's our first guy. And immediately get revenge killed there. Are you a 79U? Um, one nice thing though, oh, there's a guy. Um, one nice thing is that since this still is an LMG, it technically has the range of an LMG, which, you know, I was talking about how this is kind of like an SMG, but it definitely still has that LMG range. Oh, man. He didn't even trip my trip mine. And got me again. Same guy. Are you a 79? You. So, maybe, maybe this time I'll try this side. Otherwise, we might have to go up on top just to change things around a little bit. Um, but climbing up that ladder makes you really vulnerable. I thought I heard somebody... Oh, there's somebody across. Okay, got them. Alright. And then... Okay, got him. Perfect. So, now there's somebody just above. We'll play that and maybe reposition here, see what they do. Oh, they didn't actually charge down here. Okay, taking him out. Oh, and there's another guy right there. Didn't hit fire in time, though. The one downside of this, though, is that I will be, I'm running out of ammo a lot faster, because you know I only have the 30 rounds. I could switch to that 35 round mag, but still, I'm going to be running out of ammo a lot faster than I would if I had the regular base mag, the 100 round. But, like I said, I'm just kind of trying something new here, just to see how it works out. Okay, here's some footsteps, although they could be like way above me. Um, and then, you know, there's no way I'd be able to hit. Oh, hello, I guess you were right next to me. Oh, there's two guys with our US 79 U's. Both with the Playmaker Epic Camo. That's interesting. Alright, you know what? We're gonna go up top. We're gonna go up top. See if the game plays better from up top here. Okay, a teammate, I think just died. No, not quite. We're going to assist a teammate there. And more people. Alright, one headshot. Take that guy out. We need a reload. I uh, can't quite get that guy. Is somebody coming across now, too? 
can't tell. Okay, there's a guy there. Maybe he's coming around. Get that guy. Get this guy. Okay. Yeah, good thing we went up top. It's definitely going a lot better than the beginning of the half. So we get to switch. And I'm already 9 and 4. So, good thing I went up top. Oh, hello. Let's see if the dog can take that guy out. Thank you, dog. Now that the dog is down here, we'll send up the UAV and pause for a second to let the map update. Let's see where everybody is. Toss the trip mine, and everyone's on the opposite side of the map, so we'll see if we can see them. And yeah. Oh, there's a guy behind me, though. Get this guy. Can we get him? Got it. Oh, I really thought we had him there. Okay, well, I guess the Type 25 outfire rates my Holger. Up close, you're not going to be missing the shots. So let's place that. Oh, hello. You're not going to trigger that? And you just didn't even care that I was there? Apparently. That's fine with me. I'll take the kill. But definitely up top is where we're going to go here. Yeah. Oh, that's a sneaky spot. Okay, there's somebody across. They're going to find me. Yeah, run into me. Take him out. Take the other one out. Perfect double kill. Now there's another guy coming across here. Look at that LMG range that I was talking about. Still have that LMG range with the SMG kind of mobility. So, that's one kill. Where are you? Oh man, they're surrounding me. And that guy's got one shot left. Let's have help from the shocker. See? Oh, I didn't get my reload in. Let's switch to the pistol. Oh, got him. Okay. Normally, I don't switch to other weapons when I'm doing a video on a primary weapon, but I didn't want to die, so they're going on a good streak. Got that kill. Wasn't the prettiest, but we got it. So, oh, more people coming across. Line that up. Take them out. Headshot. This is feeling really good. I'm really glad I tried this. Oh, more people across? Yeah, look at that. Okay, got them. Also have LMG level um, wall penetration, too. So another upside as opposed to using an SMG. But saw somebody on the UAV. Oh, they're climbing the ladder. Got that one. And it will pick that up in case we need it because I only have 35 rounds left. Let's do the dog again. Dodge out of the way there. We can call in the counter UAV. Oh, there's somebody else here again. Got him. Dog's putting in work. This is a great spot here. I think this is the way to play frontline on this map. Now we're on a 15 kill streak. Did we even die this half? I don't even remember. Okay, just need one more kill. Oh, I thought maybe I could get the last kill. That's okay. We still won. I bet it was the MVP too. Yeah, definitely. Probably had like 20 something kills. Yeah, a double kill there. I think this was probably double kill. Yeah, double kill there too. 84. Alright. So 84 comes out to 26 and 5. So I did die once in the second half, but playing up top was definitely the way to go. If you liked this gunsmith, um, the only downside is that it wasn't sound suppressed, but otherwise, if you like it, use it. Let me know how it goes. I'm curious. I think this could maybe take off a little bit. Thanks for watching.